So this is now original sound turned on, check one, two, three. Original sound turned on, check one, two, three. Uh, let's turn off original sound. Now original sound is turned off. Is there a difference that matters? Let me turn it back on. So that gives us the sense of how this new algorithm actually improves sound. Hey guys, how's it going? So you've been using Zoom for a while now, right? And are you like me and you've never been quite happy with the sound where it was like, okay, I can hear somebody's talking, but in a way it's like, um, well, it's a little garbled. It's a little bit like that flangey effect, what we call it, music flanging. There's some phase, phase issue, it can, weird things where like, you know, the frequencies reduce the dynamic ranges were just not good quality, in short, overly compressed. Now with version 3.2, Zoom improved that supposedly and says, hey, we now have high quality audio. So let's test that now. Um, even if it's just an improvement, we'll take it, uh, it's better. So um, to do that, we wanna turn on original sound. Let me show you, I'm gonna share my screen with you in this case here really quickly. Um, Yes, so we have this button up here, original sound. Now, if you don't see this, you go into settings, into audio settings, and then um, go into advanced, and then see this, you have show emitting option to enable original sound. Now I'm talking through the MacBook Pro speakers. Um, I'm gonna turn on original sound. So I'm through the MacBook Pro speakers. Do you hear a difference? Check one, two, check one, two. If you feel like you're too low in the sound or too loud or clipping, keep an eye on this. This should never be in the red here. It should be always, you know, somewhere like about, not in the, in the yellow, then it's too low. If it, if it goes all the way up here, um, it's too high. So somewhere around here, I would say. And um, the, the new settings that we have here is now use fidelity music modes. If you share music, the music's not gonna get chopped up and down sampled. You actually, they can hear what you're hearing. It's pretty close. I tested it with Amazon Music and it gives you better sound. So there's no reason not to enable this unless you have a weak internet connection or a weak CPU. It gives you that warning here. So if you, you know, you have a slow upload speed or a lot of people using this at the same time, use uh, your internet connection, then you may wanna not do that. Here's stereo audio. Um, we can check this out really quickly. I mean, this microphone is mono. I'm not sure if that does anything. Let's check it out. We're gonna switch to the speakers here. To um, I say speakers, why can't I say, my, I'm a musician, I can't say microphone, that is, that is strange. MacBook Pro microphone here. So your, your MacBook Pro, your new MacBook Pros have two or three microphones or more even microphones built in so they can pick up direction, but they also give you a better representation of sound and they, you know, they can do smart things with it. So now stereo audio is enabled and then uh, we have a turn on original sound. We have to turn that on now um, because we changed. Every time we change the sound source, we lose that because we didn't select it right here. So we want to turn on, we want to switch it. So let's see, Universal Audio Thunderbolt always gets high fidelity sound. Let's see if we switch to Universal Audio Thunderbolt. Um, it retains that setting, it retains the original sound, but let me see if I switch to now um, the AirPod. Uh, see, it lost it. So that's something to keep in mind. You can preset it to automatically jump, but only for one. So you cannot have multiple selections here. So keep that in mind. If you switch in mid presentation, uh, your audio source, uh, you might lose your turn on settings if you have three, four, five different things connected to it. Um, if you only have uh, one, then you're pretty safe. All right, so I'm gonna turn on original sound. Um, and where 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 were we? We want to go back to um, Pro microphone. We're going to turn on original sound. So this is my left speaker. This is my right speaker. Does that do anything? Is it really stereo? I have not uh, no idea. We're finding this out together. That is about all I got for you. So again, version 5.3 and up. If you feel you have version 5.3, something below 5.3, I encourage you to update. 
Hey, Massive Beats here. Thank you so much for checking in, for tuning in, for watching and listening and commenting. Please like and subscribe. I'm grateful for it. And we'll do more videos. All right, bye.